हेलो स्टूडेंट वेलकम टू दिस वीडियो दिस इज लेक्चर नंबर सिक्स ऑलरेडी लेक्चर फाइव आर कॉम्प्लीटेड एंड विच आर सॉल्व द सप्लीमेंटरी प्रॉब्लम ऑफ द वेक्टर एंड स्केलर ऑफ दिस बुक वेक्टर एनालिसिस बाय द एमर्स पर जेल ओके इफ यू डू नॉट सी द लेक्चर वन टू फाइव यू गेट टू डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स एंड गेट द लिंक प्ले लिस्ट यू कैन सी दी अदर्स प्रीवियस वीडियो ओके in this video and this video we want to solve this question the question says that the graph the vector field defined by this b x y at x i comma x j okay so if i want to find out this graph i want to draw a table of value of x y and then xi minus yz okay first one is take as 2 0 so what is the value 2 i cap <coughs> and parallelly i want to draw the graph this is x and this is y so uh, 2 0 is the point is here and d to i cap that's mean this is along that direction if i want to change the pen color this is in that direction okay and <coughs> the take as minus 2 0 that is minus 2 i cap so at that point minus this is minus 2 0 so it is along that direction okay similarly 0 2 What is for zero to minus two j cap? Zero to means that point and minus two j cap. <coughs> minus two j cap means minus two j cap means in the inward direction. Zero minus two that is the that point and this is two j cap. Two j cap means this is along that direction. Okay, we got this four point. Take two two. If two two means at that point. This will be two i cap minus two j cap. Two i cap minus two j cap. Two i cap is along that direction. Minus two j cap is that direction. So the resultant will be in that direction. Similarly, two minus two y is minus two. That means that point in this direction. Two i cap minus minus plus two j cap. Two i cap means along that direction. Two j cap in that direction. So the resultant will be in that direction. Okay. <coughs> similarly minus 2 2 x is minus 2 y is positive in this so minus 2 i cap minus 2 j cap minus 2 i cap means along that minus 2 j cap will be along that and resultant will be along that direction so minus 2 minus 2 will be minus 2 i cap plus 2 j cap so at that point i cap is minus and z cap is plus so resultant will be this <laughs> so you can say at a particular uh, sphere at a particular radii the radius is constant at particular radius the nature will be like that the nature will be like uh, that <coughs> this is the resultant this is the resultant so the resultant will be change like that okay and uh, this will be change like that this will be change like that <coughs> similarly and that similarly like that <coughs> so you can draw in a phrase <coughs> as the at a certain distance this is along that this is along that and change is like 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 okay like that i think i understand my point this is like like okay <coughs> that's mean this is in the form of like that along and this is along in this in this this in this okay this this 
this okay this is for this function a a for for a the graph is that clear now if i want to find for function b and uh, again we can calculate for uh, y i cap minus x j cap <coughs> what is the value of that c 0 to 0 that means this is 0 this is minus 2 j cap so <coughs> if i want to find here 2 0 and this is minus 2 j cap and along that direction and minus 2 0 minus 2 0 means this is 2 j cap so at that point this is 2 j cap along that direction and 0 2 this is 0 and this is 2 2 i cap 0 2 2 i cap that is that direction 0 3 minus 2 i cap this is that direction okay for 2 2 this is 2 this is 2 2 i cap minus 2 j cap so 2 i cap minus 2 j cap so this is the resultant and 2 minus 2 2 minus 2 this is minus 2 i cap minus 2 j cap 2 minus 2 at that point minus 2 i cap minus 2 j cap so resultant will be along that direction <coughs> minus 2 2 minus 2 2 that is 2 i cap and that is 2 j cap so minus 2 2 at that point this is plus this is plus the resultant will be along that direction and minus 2 minus 2 this is minus 2 i cap and this is plus 2 j cap so at that point i is minus j is plus so resultant will be that direction so you can see you can see in the in this region uh, this is along that vector if i change this color uh, this is along that vector this is along this this along this so this will be the tangent of this circle okay so this will be the channel of the circle and if we increase this value the uh, value will be increases if we increase this radius value if we increase the radius then the magnitude will be increase okay the tangent <coughs> this will be the tangent this is for option b is uh, answer of this b and this is very easy this is nothing but r vector by r this is r cap for r cap this is a three dimension then this is spherical this is spherical dimension or given the outward this is nothing but the outward outward okay i think clear <coughs> this take as your homework and do this and this is very simple this is also as a homework take as homework do this three sum this is also take as homework do this three sum and comment in within this work if there is any problem please comment within the description below okay thank you this is all about me and this is my contact details you can contact with me by a whatsapp or telegraph channel this is the my youtube channel like this session share this video with your friends Just subscribe this channel to get the upcoming video and press the bell icon thank you we will meet in the next video take care